Okay, so for this video, I'm doing unboxing and review on the Aitora Polar Bar. So stay tuned to the end and I'll tell you my thoughts on it, as well as show you how to use it. Okay, let's start the unboxing process. Once you open up the box, this is everything it comes with. Uh, the first thing you see there is a manual. It gives you directions, uh, shows you how to use it. Uh, it's pretty easy and straightforward. I'll demonstrate it later on. And it gives you details about the pull-up bar. It comes on this nice little bag you can use to carry it with, with the Aitara name brand right there. And inside this white package is the pull-up bar. As you can see, it's packaged pretty well, so you're not going to have any issues with shipping or being damaged or anything like that. And once you take it out the white plastic container, it's the clear plastic around it. And once you take it out, there it is right there, the polar bar. And to add, this is already assembled, so there's no special tools or you don't have to put it together. It comes as is and ready to use just like that. And that's everything that comes in the Aitora Polar Bar. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you how to use this Polar Bar. You just open the clamp like this and just place it on top of a door frame. It fits most standard door frames, so make sure you test it out. And you grab the other bar and you open it up. And once you let go, it'll close and clamp down. And once it's parallel to the frame, you just pull it down for a bit to make sure it's secure and it won't go anywhere. And just like that, you could use it to do pull-ups. Pretty simple and straightforward to use, right out the box. And here's just an up-close look of how the pull-up bar attached to the door frame. And just like that, it's pretty easy. It doesn't look like it would do any damage to the door frame. And just a little bit, I'll show you my old pull-up bar, but this is the new one I got from Aitora. Also, keep in mind the maximum weight capacity for this pull-up bar on a door frame is 330 pounds or 149 kilograms. And this right here is the old pull-up bar I use. It's pretty nice and sturdy. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like it, but over time, as you can see, it does do some type of damage to the door frame. I don't mind it because I only use it down here, but yeah, keep in mind with pull-up bars, they can damage your door frame over time. But so far, this one, it looks like it's pretty sturdy and it caused very minimum damage, if there's any at all. As you can see too, it's pretty quick and easy to set up. Just attach it to the door frame. And keep in mind the handles that I'm holding right here, it can rotate as well. So you can do different types of grips and pull and rotate the handles different ways. As you can see, I'm doing here. And once you're done, just open the grip and just take it off and it comes off just like that. But once they close on the door frame, it's pretty sturdy. So you don't have to worry about it falling. So yeah, these pull-up bars are great for doing pull-ups, chin-ups, and different variation of pull-ups and chin-ups um, that you can do with them. But uh, keep in mind, you should not be shaking your whole body during using this pull-up bar. And you should definitely not be working out if you have any pain or discomfort. So make sure you're cleared by a medical professional or healthcare provider before you begin any type of workout program. Here's another angle of me using them to do chin-ups. And here I got my little brother who's also my cameraman to do some chin-ups with them too. Uh, my little brother is actually Scorpion in a lot of my videos too. I don't know if you notice. And once you're done you can just take it off and that's it. So overall what do I think about these polar bars from Aitora? They're pretty good design. Uh, it's really easy to use and it's pretty durable. So you're not gonna have any issues with quality for these uh, pull-up bars. And the thing I like about them is they come as is like this already assembled. So you don't have to waste time uh, putting it together. You don't need any special equipment. You could pretty much use it right off the box. You just gotta open these up and put it on your door frame and that's it so yeah this is good for your home gym if you don't have a lot of space in your house and you travel a lot say you're going somewhere and you want to take your workout with you 
these would be great for that just attach these to the door uh, pretty much any door and from the looks of it it doesn't look like it does damage to your door frame and I use all types of pull-up bars before and a lot of them over time would do some type of damage to your door frame so keep in mind but uh, these look really durable um, really good quality so I definitely see myself using these more compared to my other pull-up bars and that's about it um, for this review let me know if you guys have any questions or suggestion uh, definitely leave a comment below and let me know if this is something you would get or if you use a pull-up bar at home let me know what kind you use and if you're interested in buying this pull-up bar I'll leave a link in the description below check out iThora on Amazon they got a lot of different products also if you're interested I did a unboxing and a reveal for an iThora push-up board it's a pretty neat product um, it's a board that you can use to do all types of push-ups with it as well as different workouts so if you're on the market for extra workout equipment definitely check out iThora and check out the video below where I reveal another product of theirs that's all guys let me know if you have any comments or suggestion and uh, let me know what type of pull-up bar you use if you use one at home uh, take care guys be safe and I'll see you in the next one bye <laughs>